I say yo, welcome to the BBW show, you feel me? We talk battle rap, basketball, and wrestling. And the topic today is wrestling. More importantly, you feel me? Eva Marie's Monday Night Raw debut, you feel me? A lot of people had a lot to say about her segment for Monday Night Raw, you feel me? Now, here's my a couple thoughts I had, you feel me? All right. Excuse me. Excuse me. One, people say, um, all right. So on Twitter, it went trended that Naomi deserves better. You feel me? And I kind of agree with that to an extent. To an extent. You feel me? Naomi was off TV for months. And I don't think it was nothing wrong with her. She just was off TV. You feel me? Two, Naomi deserves better, but Naomi, she's a former champion, right? We don't know if she's very versatile because she doesn't show it. You feel me? The only thing we see is the dancing, shaking booty Naomi. You feel me? Not that I don't like it. I love it. But I feel like that's all she does. You feel me? Everybody wants her to be moved to SmackDown to be with the Usos or something. I don't know if I want that, you feel me? Everybody want to turn here with Bobby Lashley. Probably, probably, probably. I would buy into that more than the Usos thing, you feel me? Like, I don't, me personally, I don't like putting the couples together just because they're a couple, you feel me? It's like, that's cute and all that, but y'all don't got to do that with every couple, you feel me? Like, they never did that with Andrade and Charlotte. They was never together on TV. So I was like, y'all don't got to do that. We've barely seen Moxley and Renee Young together on TV. And when they did, they never acknowledged it. You feel me? You feel me? They started doing the Seth Rollins, Becky Lynch thing because they both was hot at the time. You feel me? Say what you want. They both was hot at the time. And they was doing it on social media. You feel me? So I feel like... They pick and choose, you feel me, sometimes. But every couple doesn't have to be with together on TV. So that's one thing. Another thing I saw was, um, all right, so if you missed it, and I've waited two minutes to say it. If you missed it, Piper Niven debuted with her, you feel me? So they're doing the thing where, like, Eva Marie has somebody wrestle for her, you feel me? But she still counts it as a win for herself, you feel me? Which gets heat, you feel me? So Piper never squashes Naomi, you feel me? All right. Um, it been a lot of things about Piper Niven, you feel me? People was body shaming her, you feel me? Because she doesn't look like every wrestler, you feel me? She doesn't look like every female wrestler on the brand, you feel me? And people was like, because they didn't acknowledge her as Piper Niven, you feel me? Which I don't have a problem with. Let me say why I don't have a problem with that. All right, so NXT is on the USA brand, right? NXT does about 700,000, you feel me? On a good week, 700,000. Monday Night Raw does about 1.7. On a good week, 1.7. That's a million viewers. A million viewers apart. That's not five or 10, a million viewers apart. So, a bunch of people that watch NXT, a bunch of people that watch Raw don't know, don't watch NXT. It's clear as day. They're literally on the same show the day after. So, it's clear that a bunch of people that watch Raw don't watch NXT. With that being said, then imagine the people that watch Raw that don't watch NXT UK. Because I don't think she's ever been on NXT Prime. So, how many people, like, bro... Think of that, bro. She has never been on NXT UK, so you want to come in with a whole brand new, like, bro, you can't do that, bro. And she's not a big name like a Tyler Bate, you feel me? She's not a Tyler Bate. She's not. She's not a Tyler Bate. She's not a Walter. Those are the big stars from NXT UK. Or Pete Dunne. I don't think they're going to change Pete Dunne name on the main roster. Why? Because he's a big fucking star. Piper Niven is not... 
And I'm not even saying she's a bad wrestler or nothing, but she, her name isn't doesn't draw that much, you feel me? No offense, but if they bring some people in from Impact, like a Jordan Grace, you feel me? She reminds me of a Jordan Grace. If they bring Jordan Grace in, I don't see them keeping Jordan Grace's name. Like, I can see them changing her name too, you feel me? So I feel like that's another thing. Like, they didn't call her that. They didn't call her Piper Niven. People like, oh, they make people look so stupid. They insult the intelligence of the fans. No. Everybody's not on Instagram and Twitter like everybody, bro. Everybody doesn't watch every every NXT show, all of that. Some people literally just watch Monday Night Raw. So if you're going to come here and you tell me, Oh my God, it's Piper Niven. It's Piper Niven. I'm going to be like, who? Why are you going so happy? Has she ever been on this show? Why are we so happy for that? Like, we can't do that because I've criticized AW for that, for going crazy for the Butcher and the Blade, and we've never seen them before. So it's like, why would we go crazy for people that we've never seen, who's not stars? You feel me? You're not a Walter, shorty. I'm sorry. You feel me? That's the other thing. Now, the body shame and stuff, I don't like. You feel me? But it, it's people can't pick and choose. You feel me? People can't pick and choose. Not even saying the wrestlers. I'm saying like wrestling fans can't pick and choose, you feel me? Y'all can't make fun of somebody's body and then when they make fun of one of your favorite wrestlers' body, you're like, oh my God, stop doing that. Like, no, wrestling is a toxic fucking business, bro. Gangsta. Wrestling is toxic community. That's that, you feel me? But I'm glad they doing this with Piper Niven. Good for her. Ro needs some new women. I'm glad Eva Marie's not wrestling. I'm glad it's not Mercedes Martinez. Like, it's a lot of positives from it for me, you feel me? But that's just me. That's just my opinion, you feel me? Let me know what you think in the comment section. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll be back with more.